really thank everyone for coming out today. My name is Keith Krauss, and I'll be discussing uh, the benefits of kettlebell training and demonstrating some three examples uh, that you can include in your workout routine. Um, I know everyone here is interested in fitness or sports performance or exercise and strength, and kettlebells are a great way to improve all of those areas. Um, I'm a certified personal trainer under both American Council on Exercise and National Academy of Speed and Explosion. And I just recently received training on the use of kettlebells here at Union College at the Pennsylvania Strength and Conditioning Clinic. And since everyone is familiar with the general use of kettlebells and what they are, um, I'm going to show you three specific exercises that allow you to target particular muscles. Um, kettlebells are very versatile pieces of equipment. Um, they come in all different sizes, so anyone of any age or gender can use them in their workouts. Um, you can target multiple muscle groups or you can isolate individual muscles. Um, they will really save you time and money. Um, a pair of kettlebells like this will cost you about $50, whereas you could end up spending thousands of dollars on multiple pieces of gym equipment if you want a regular kind of workout. Um, and kettlebells are usually used in more of an up-tempo pace, so it'll be more efficient and it'll save you time. Um, kettlebell training is widely recognized at all levels of fitness, um, even at the NFL level. Um, Jeff Fish, a strength and conditioning coach for the Oakland Raiders, said that kettlebells acted as a assistant coach to him because it would help point out any deficiencies that any players had and it would help them work on those to prevent injuries. Um, the journal of strength and conditioning research uh, showed that kettlebells um, had a direct translation to improvement of strength, muscle growth, power, and endurance, similar to that of Olympic lifting. Um, I've used kettlebells myself for years in my own training, and in my personal training career, I train my clients kettlebells as well and I've never heard any negative feedback on any of the exercises that I've used in the training. Um, if you're using kettlebells correctly you can burn up to 400 calories in 20 minutes which is pretty efficient compared to most forms of exercise and the American Council on Exercise who I have one of my certifications through um, said that you can burn up to 1,200 calories in an hour which as opposed to like running you wouldn't you would only burn up half of that in the same amount of time. Um, kettlebell's main uh, point of focus um, help you develop explosive strength. And what I mean by that is um, explosive strength is the ability to generate a maximum amount of force in a minimal amount of time. Um, okay, at this time I'll have my assistant come up demonstrate three exercises. Um, the first exercise is a two-arm swing and that involves one kettlebell. Go ahead and do like about three of those. Well, the goal of those is to really squat down deep and explode so hard that you don't have to lift the kettlebell with your arms. You only just want it to come up naturally because you're exploding so hard. Um, and that will target all of your lower body, your quads, hamstrings, calves, your hips, everything. Um, the next exercise is a squat to shoulder press that involves both kettlebells. That is more of a full body movement there. It involves really almost all of your muscle groups. Um, you got your calves, hamstrings, quads, shoulders, triceps, your chest is involved. That's a really efficient uh, movement. Um, the other one is a one arm holding swing. This is a little bit more advanced. Um, you probably wouldn't try this until when you're feeling more comfortable with the kettlebell. This is another variation of an exercise you can do. That involves switching hands on the upward phase. Thank you. Um, 
these demonstrations only showed you a few exercises that you can do with kettlebells. Um, there are literally hundreds of different ways you can use kettlebells for exercise. Um, you can like I said earlier, you can target any desired muscle with kettlebells. You can do one at a time, or you can target full body movements. Um, kettlebells will work everything from your core to your legs, arms, chest, back, and shoulders. Um, if you're starting out with kettlebells, you would probably want to start out with maybe 15 pound kettlebells. Um, we use 25 pound kettlebells here in our demonstration. And uh, hopefully these exercises I've shown you today will help you in your fitness endeavors. And you'll be able to include them in your daily routine. Um, are there any questions? Yeah? It's just really it mimics the same motion as a as your vertical jump. I mean, you're going to take off with two feet, and you all these exercises that you're doing involve that same squatting motion and exploding up. And I mean, I've used these for years, and my vertical is around 36 inches, and I know it's been shown to improve the vertical jump when used correctly. Okay. Yeah. Are they all, all the exercises that you would use them for? Are they generally like the squat position is the point to kind of a lot of them are, but you can do push-ups on them. Um, you can do a push-up to a row with them. You could use them almost as if they were dumbbells too. I mean, they're really multi-purpose, but they are a little more convenient. Like for those motions we were doing, where you're swinging them, like swinging between your legs and stuff, you wouldn't do want to do that with like a dumbbell. So, mm -hmm. but they're yeah, they're really multi-purpose. You can do any exercise you would do with other pieces of equipment with these and save yourself the cost with just buying these. my speech. Thank you to everyone for coming and hopefully you've learned some useful kettlebell exercises. <laughs>